What's up, everyone? Welcome to Power Play with CJ, Prospect Profiles. Do you want to focus in on Brendan Lemieux and then Barry Colts? And I know many of you at home saying, Lemieux? Mario's kid? No, even better. Uh, Claude's son. I uh, was born in Denver when Claude was in the um, was with the Avalanche. Obviously, won the Stanley Cup there. Um, and we'll talk about it in a second. But you know, let's focus in on this kid's game. The, the comparisons are, uh, are definitely apt between father and son. You know, the apple doesn't fall too far from the tree. I picked up a few suspensions last year, uh, his first year in the Ontario League. He actually started last year in the USHL with um, the Green Bay Gamblers after committing to North Dakota. And then uh, four, go, four went that commitment and signed with Barry last year and was part of the team that went to the OHL uh, finals. You know, I think he had, two, he had two goals in 21 playoff games, 14 points, 46 regular season games. This year he's got sixteen point. He's got four points and 16 penalty minutes through 10 games, so not exactly offensive numbers. But, you know, you're not necessarily looking for him from that. He's uh, definitely got the agitator, get under guy's skin, play physical um, degree to his game that, you know, his old man had. And uh, to be honest with you, I can see a little bit of Brad Marchand in him, you know, in terms of just getting under the skin and making other teams hate you, which, um, you know, there's something to be said for that because, you know, the Bruins won the Stanley Cup with uh, Marchand being, you know, a player at the forefront, you know, coming in with uh, clutch goals, actually a lot like Claude Lemieux, and, uh, you know, playing physical and, and just, you know, doing doing what needed to be, do, needed to be done, and, uh, you know, I was just looking at his highlights between the Gamblers and, uh, and the Colts, and, you know, the physical game is there, and, uh, you know, he's picked up, in, I think, an eight-game suspension in, I believe, his first month with um, in the OHL. So, you know, the, the like I said, the apple does not fall far from the tree. And, uh, you know, I'm curious to see what developments he takes going forward. Um, you know, kind of filling Anthony Kamara's role on the, on the Colts, bring, being a physical presence, and, uh, you know, chipping in with some timely offense. Now, he doesn't have Mark Scheifele to ride shotgun with, but, um, you know, between him and Ekblad, uh, this Barry Colts team is going to be something to watch um, throughout the year, and, you know, definitely team I'll be keeping my eye on. And, uh, you know, like I said, I... I he plays rough. Let's, I mean, that's no secret. Uh, you know, I'd like to see him be a little more disciplined. But the thing of it, and, you know, to the point where he's not hurting people. He's, the thing with guys like him is you tell them to not to rail it back. They lose their edge. They're not as effective. You know, anytime the Bruins have railed Marshawn and he's just not as he's just not on his game. And I think that's why he's struggling to start the season. Um, you know, he really hasn't been going out there, you know, pissing guys off. And I think you know he's got to find a happy medium between doing that and not putting. Uh, other players at risk and putting his team, you know, in detriment in terms of, you know, stupid penalties. So that's me something to watch. And I could see him going in the top three rounds this year. You know, certain GMs love bloodlines, and obviously it's there. And I'm curious to see, um, you know, where he goes and what happens to him. I think he's going to be in juniors for two more years after this. And, uh, you know, if he can break out the way, like I said, Anthony Kamara did in his fourth, third or fourth years in juniors, that's going to be something to watch. Anyway, that's on this episode of The Power Play with CJ Prospect Profiles on a uh, Brandon Lemieux with the Barry Colts. Stay tuned for more episodes throughout the season and beyond. Later, guys.